Yo, this is Jarmancer here, and today we are back. And today we are going to be playing some Planet Side 2. And today we're actually going to just be playing some basic Planet Side 2 gameplay. I was asked on one of my Killstreak videos that I could just show some gameplay because there are people on my channel who don't play Planet Side 2. And if you all would like to know more about it, then I thought I would play some for you all to see what it's like. So it's a first person shooter and it's a multiplayer game and it's free to play so you can go and download it and just play it. Um, I'm going to be playing on the new conglomerate. There's three different factions. My faction, the new conglomerate, focuses on heavy hitting weapons but they don't have the best reload times or the fastest fire rates. Um, there's another faction called the Van of Sovereignty and they have alien technology and so they focus on lasers and they're focused on accuracy and then the Terran Republic they're the red guys they just have old-fashioned weapons like our weapons nowadays because this first-person shooter is centered in the future and so the Terran Republic has old-fashioned weapons like ours that just fire really fast and the new conglomerate they are the rebels and so a lot of their weapons are experimental and they're based around Gauss technology if you don't know what that is then you uh, it's technology where you get uh, electromagnetic coils and you sh send energy through them and then they can send out uh, energy to shoot bullets we actually have some gas guns but they're not effective at all uh, well I in real life I would say not in plant side 2 here they're pretty effective okay we're going to fly over to this base here, I think. Let's. So we're spawning at a base here, and uh, by the way, the little box up in the corner that says Sessions, Kills, KDR, uh, HSR, and Player, Weapon, and KDR, uh, that is an add on that I have for Planet Side 2. You don't normally get that in Planet Side 2. That's just a little stat tracker that lets me know how I'm doing in game. And then it also gives little announcements that sound like the Unreal Tur Unreal Tournament announcements. If you've seen any of those videos, I've had I've had this add-on in some of my kill streaks, like uh, two or three of them. Okay, where are we heading? Uh, so this here is a Reaver. It is the Empire-specific fighter. Each fighter, each uh, Empire has their own fighter jet. Um, the new conglomerate is all focused around heavy hitting and high health things, so we have a lot of health here. He's going to run away because he sees that I'm hovering over there with some rocket pods. Um, and then the VS have a really, probably the best aircraft. It's super maneuverable. Oh, just about hit him. Um, and then the TR have a really, really fast attack craft that, oh, I'm getting shot at from above, um, that is really annoying to try and take out, but it's not, uh, it's not as good as the VS fighter, I'd say, but that's just my personal opinion, so, okay, let's see here, let's try and take out this turret here. Those are anti-aircraft turrets that are trying to shoot all of us in the air down. So we're going to try and take it down. So if other aircraft come in, it will be easier for them. There's actually a scythe right there. We should probably try and take it out. The new conglomerate my faction has a lot of shotguns and so I actually have a shotgun on my uh, plane here and I'm really a bad dogfighter so this is probably not the best idea to be going after this guy but for demonstrative purposes and he's not the best pilot either so at least not so far he's probably a lot better than me okay where do you go
I hear him somewhere around here, but I have no idea where. I think he's trying to shoot rockets at me. There he is. Yeah, we should probably head back because if he's good, he'll just destroy me, so. There's a galaxy right there. It's an enemy galaxy. That's a transport vehicle I'm getting shot at. Oh, that's a uh, friendly. Whoops. Somebody, uh, infiltrators can hack turrets, and so one of the friendly infiltrators hacked a turret, it seems like. We're going to bail here, actually. And we're going to drop down in here. Oh, he killed me. But I killed him. So that's a little taste of what the uh, air game is like. I'm pretty, a really bad pilot. Um, I mean, I'm okay, but when it comes to dogfights, I'm awful. But our, my Empire-specific fighter isn't very good at dogfights anyway. It's more for taking out ground troops. Ouch. Um, which is what I'm best at, so. Let's see here. So, there's enemies. Yeah, I think Light Assault is what we need to s stick as, which is the class I'm right I am right now. We have a jetpack. I mostly play Light Assault and Infiltrator. I like to focus on mobility and s being sneaky. Pull out a med kit there and we'll stab ourselves with it. Oh, well, got shot anyways. Actually, I think we're going to go around as infiltrator because the rooftops are pretty covered right now. People are really looking to kill us. We're actually kind of getting camped here. Ow. So infiltrator has a cloak. And all those guys are heading the wrong direction. The way we should be heading is toward the capture point here. But everybody's just sitting over there. Um, because if we hold the capture point for long enough, then uh, we capture the base. So let's throw it on a sensor dart, which will send out little radar pulses and tell us if there are enemies nearby. There's another info, somebody with an SMG over here, which I have an SMG as well. We don't want anybody to see us. There he is. Got him. Okay. Throw down another dart. Let our cloak go all the way back up, and then we're going to make a run for it. Okay, there's a Maxo in here, so we should be safe if we stay near him. Well, relatively safe. Okay, we're capturing the point here. Because these Max suits, they're big hulks of armor that you can get inside. They can't capture points. Um, so we just captured the point here. And now we got to hold out for... Oh, uh, seven minutes. You can see over there uh, on the left there oh you can see how long we have left until we capture the base oh there's an enemy cloaker nearby you can hear them because they have each faction has a distinctive sound for their cloak oh well somebody with an SMG got me SMGs are great for close quarters and they're really f 
mostly fast firing, but um, they not very good past like 10 meters. So I'm actually using an SMG as well. Uh, let's see here. There's a Sunder. You can spawn at Sunders. Hopefully that. Yeah, there's three tanks over there, so he's screwed. Um, I'm not in a squad, so I can't uh, drop in with the squad. Uh, I can't. Squad beacon, that's what it's called. Um, let's just see. Nope. Uh, we'll, we'll try to go here. Let's see. So this is called instant action. If you hit I, then it will just drop pod you onto a heated battle. So let's check this battle out. Because there aren't any spawns at the last base we were at, so we're going to try and check out this base and see if it's any good. Or the battle, not the base. Okay. So we have a bridge here and a couple towers, and all the tanks are just sitting right there. And I'm going to die. Unless I do something fast. Throw it on a dart. Oh, and he got me. Right under that bridge there, there's all the enemies. Like right there. So we need to get down there. Uh, let's grab Engineer. And we're going to go hop in a tank. Okay. Um, let's see here. There's a terminal over here for vehicles. The class I'm playing here is Engineer, and they have this repair tool, and they can repair turrets and vehicles and other and Mac suits and other things that. Uh, are technical that can be damaged. You can actually even repair these uh, terminals. Okay, so we're going to grab a lightning, which is a tank. It's actually um, what's called uh, a Nanite Systems tank. And uh, what Nanite Systems is, is it's a group who sells um, weapons and other things that all factions are able to use because other things other weapons like the weapon the SMG that I was just using um, only my faction can use it uh, but this tank here all factions can use this tank and I don't know why this guy's shooting at me because bullets. Oh well, somebody dropped down and dropped some C4 on my tank there. So we're gonna switch over to heavy assault, and heavy assault has a rocket launcher, so we'll be able to use this rocket launcher to uh, combat the tanks that are approaching in this little valley here. And that is. I didn't realize that that was a bad guy because of his camo. You saw that I didn't die there for a second because um, heavy assaults have an overshield. If I press the uh, ability key, then you can see this blue gl glow around me, and I can uh, sustain more damage when I have um, when I have that overshield on. Let's try and find. There he is. And there's another one of them. Yeah, people are just approaching from right over here, so that's not good. Let's actually try and approach them using Infiltrator so they don't see us coming. And then we'll use some sensor darts, just put them out over there. And then let's try and... I'm a horrible shot with pistols. Got him. Okay, let's see here. I think there are a few other guys around here. Um, they might have gotten killed, though. Yeah, let's head back and grab Heavy Assault. 
Though there could be a Sunderer somewhere down there. I don't know. We'll grab Heavy Assault and... We'll see if we can help take out any approaching enemy vehicles and hopefully push them back and actually start attacking their base. So let's see here. Oh, there's somebody up over there. There's a medic. Medics can heal and revive people from their team. Okay, that's a friendly tank. So it looks like we can begin um, heading up the road here. Looks like everybody's heading here even though... You know, let's, let's head over this way. We should grab a vehicle, but we're far away from the terminal, so I think we're just gonna walk. So Nanite Systems I was talking about earlier is the dealer that uh, all factions can use their stuff. This here is a pistol that uh, Nanite Systems has. It's a revolver. So the other factions can use this same revolver as well. But the revolver that I was using a minute ago when I was playing Infiltrator, only my faction can use it. And then if there are any air vehicles, this specific rocket launcher I have here has a uh, tracking device for air vehicles on it. So I could latch on to them with my rockets and send some rockets after some air vehicles. But then it can also, you can just shoot it, which is without uh, it locking on anything, which is called dumb fire. Because it's just firing by itself. And this here, right here, is a... Uh, vehicle shield and so vehicles can't get through this until we destroy a generator and so we need to head over to this generator here and overload it and then if it overloads long enough without an enemy coming to stop it from overloading then uh, it will explode and um, that shield that vehicle shield will go down now there's actually people who have noticed me and so I'm running because I don't want them to come kill me. Um, and they're all right by the vehicle shield there. Well, vehicle shield generator, not the shield itself. Also don't want to be near that because that's a teleporter for the enemy. So we don't want an enemy to just pop out of there and shoot us. Okay, let's see here. There's a guy up on the roof there. Okay, there's actually... Hmm, let's see here. I'm going to try heading back down through these tunnels here. And getting over by the shield generator and hopefully overloading it since I was stopped from doing that earlier. Got him. So we're going to attempt to run in here without anybody seeing. And we're going to overload this shield generator here. Okay. Now, let's actually head, where should we head to? Well, well, that's a tank, enemy tank. Probably going to try and kill us. Let's head back down into these tunnels here. There's actually a, we could shoot a rocket at that, uh, one of these vehicles, but we don't want to get noticed. Somebody fix the shield generator so it's not overloading anymore. Let's 
There's an enemy tank. There's an enemy guy. And that was dumb of him. Um. Okay, let's see here. And. Um. We don't want to get spotted, though. This fight is dying out, so I think we might actually just redeploy. Because. There's not much going on here. So, yeah, I think we're going to hit the redeploy key. Actually, before we redeploy, let's just overload this generator just to annoy the people at this base here. And we also get some experience from overloading generators, so. We'll let that run. And, and we'll head back down in these tunnels so we're not noticed. Okay. Let's see here. So, there's a fight. None of the other fights have spawn points, but we might be able to... Nope, that just brings us there. So, let's spawn here. Um, let's play Infiltrator to scout out and see what it's like. And then we'll, depending upon what the base is like, we'll choose um, what class to play after that. Looks like there's heavy suppression out here. So Infiltrator is actually a good class to play in this fight. So we killed the engineer there. There's a Max. He did not notice me somehow. He's apparently just blind or a noob. Um, the Max noticed us and we died. But we ended up killing, like, let's see here, killed nine people. Wow. We didn't kill nine. I think we killed, yeah, we killed four, and then the other five are from the base that we, read, that we were at, because uh, there must be a glitch where you, you redeploy and it doesn't see a death, and so it counts it all as one life. I don't actually remember if that's like part of the game. I thought it wasn't. Because my add-on here also does that, but I don't know. I didn't think Planet Side 2 itself scored kills that way too. I don't know. Okay, so here's a fight. Um, let's see where this brings us. Well, that's the fight that that's a stale fight that we were at. We'll grab a Sunder and head up over here. And we'll be actually I think we'll play Infiltrator. I was gonna play Engineer just in case we need to hop out and quickly repair our Sunder, but we could do that anyway. Uh Oh, and there's actually some turrets up here that we need to hack. Somebody hacked all the turrets. Which actually means there could be an infiltrator around here somewhere, but... So an enemy came up and hacked our turrets here. So it slows people down if they want to come here and spawn vehicles and help out the other bases or defend against uh, oncoming vehicles. And also, all these turrets are hacked as well. And... There's another... Uh, terminal somewhere. Uh, there's an... Oh, the infiltrator is in here. There he is. I can see him. Yep, 
Yeah, he's over here. There he is. We're not completely invisible infiltrators. We have a little shimmer to us. And you can see see that shimmer if you look closely. You're probably not going to be able to notice it in the YouTube video, but he's heading off somewhere. Hopefully we can kill him. But when infiltrators stay still, they're harder to they don't really shimmer at all. They're basically invisible, so we could run into a trap. I don't know where he went. Yeah, I think we'll just head back to what we were doing. Because it could take us forever to find the infiltrator. Actually... Yeah, I think we're going to end the little episode that we have going here. I think if you guys like this, then we'll do some more of these um, Epi Planet Side 2 episodes. Hopefully you're just learning something from these, and uh, maybe you'll try out the game yourself if you like these videos. And hopefully I've also been instructional, so people who haven't played Planet Side 2. Hopefully you guys kind of know what to do now. Okay. And hopefully I'll be teaching you guys what to do throughout these episodes. And if you do install Planet Side 2 and you need any more help, then you can ask me and I can help you out. Looks like there's another infiltrator who's going to go ahead and hack that turret. Yeah, okay. So I think we'll end the episode here. And I might actually record an epi another episode like right after this. Uh, but yeah, let me know if you enjoyed this, and I will see you all later.